Oh, yeah, it's the power of a worldwide dictatorship, uh, if you want to put it that way. Um, yeah, like last time I was on your show, we talked about this new pandemic treaty that the World Health Organization is now drafting. That will be presented to us in August. But while I was looking into this new treaty, I found something else that they're also working on. And this is where it might get a little technical because there are a lot of names involved here, but hear me out. You have the World Health Organization that has a World, World Health Assembly meeting next week on the 22nd yeah. of May. And what they'll do there is they're going to vote on amendments made by the Biden administration to the international health regulations. I didn't even know we had those, but apparently we do. So there are international health regulations that stem from 2005 that are now being amended. And when you look at those amendments, what you see there is basically two trends. You see that every that a lot of power that was usually in the hand of the state parties, which, by the way, is the entire world and uh, 194 countries to be spe specific, is taken away. And a lot of power is added uh, when it comes to decisions that can be made by Dr. Tedros, the China show. And so I decided to look a little mm. bit at what these amendments say specifically. Um, and well, if you look at, for example, Amendment 12, and all of these documents are to be found on the internet, if you go to my Twitter page, you can find them really easily, is that now the World Health Organization is going to be able to determine, they are going to decide when our respective nations face a public health emergency. So they get to decide when we are dealing with a new pandemic, and they also later will get to decide through, through this new treaty that we talked about last week, how we need to respond to them. So looking at Article 12, what is a health emergency? Well, they basically say, Dr. Tedros decides. Looking at the text, it literally says, mm. I now quote him here, an event that has not been determined to meet the criteria for a public health emergency will still fall under the, uh, well, under the, um, the wallet, the, the portfolio of, of this man, Dr. Tedros. So Dr. Tedros himself, is going to decide whether we have a pandemic or not, whether we have, have a health risk. And he can just decide whenever he feels like it, if that's the case. 